And as we heard earlier, Rome is now part of the nationwide lockdown in Italy. The city relies heavily on tourism, but as COVID-19 is reported throughout the country, residents and businesses are already reporting damaging consequences. Hermione Kitson filed this report for SBS World News as locals prepare for further restrictions. The streets here in Rome are eerily quiet as a result of the coronavirus outbreak. I've spent the day speaking with locals who are worried about the economy, tourism and the health system. They say they've never seen the capital quite like this and fear the worst is yet to come. Rome's famed Piazza del Popolo, the so-called People's Square, deserted. It's a scene repeated throughout Italy's historic centre, landmark sites no longer attracting crowds from around the world. Is a real problem for the city, for the economy of the city. The flow-on effect has been immediate. This clothing shop has been in Raffaello Sarsen's family since 1970. He says there's never been a more difficult time. This is uh, right now is much worse than uh, 11 September and Chernobyl put together. This is the worst we 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 all seen right now. Da Pietro is an institution in Rome with bookings usually needed months in advance. Now the phone only rings for cancellations. È una situazione un po' triste a Roma in questo momento. Eh, dalle ultime due settimane è molto tragica. Also qua al centro storico non c'è uno straniero. Noi sono 15 anni che siamo qui e non c'era mai capitato. As the virus continues to spread, residents are doing what they can to protect themselves. Bisogna applicare le cose che ci dicono, quindi stare attenti e rimanere in casa, uscire con la maschera. I was eating lunch today and in the restaurant there was a sign saying stay away from people, like sit a meter away from other people. But amid the panic there's positivity. Everywhere in the world loves this country. I, I think that when it's going to be solved everybody will uh, give, give us a hand by coming to Rome again, <laughs> to Italy a hope shared by the country.